Hello, my friends. How are you? It's Sam I am. I'm doing fantabulistic. I hope you guys are as well. I'm here with you to do another project today. Yay! This one is something I don't, well, I said it last time. I, I don't generally do them, but I did one the other day, and I was going to try another one. Doing jewelry, and I'm going to use UV resin this time. And I got J Diction uh, UV resin with a light, a little um, silicone mat, these little cute tools they're plastic not silicone a little book to tell you how to use it some gloves and two little cute cups all that came in there and i think it was like 20 bucks something like that very inexpensive i needed some uv resin and i wanted to try j addiction i tried uh the epoxy resin store last because i've always just used the generic and to be honest with you i don't see any different in the name brands than the generic but i'm i'm giving it an honest effort looking at it. All right, let me move the boxes out of the way so you can see exactly what we are gonna be doing today. Are you ready? I know you are. All right, check it out. Oh, I forgot to take this out of the plastic. Oh, no, let me take this out of the plastic. Don't want to ruin it. So you can say, what in the world is that? We are gonna make a matching set. This is a beautiful bracelet. Isn't that pretty? Sorry for the paint on my hands. Then we got the ring. It's adjustable. And then we have the pretty pendant. Teardrop. So we have the three pieces. And guess what I'm going to do? I know I just did a can breast cancer awareness, but it is that time. So I'm going to do the jewelry. I'm going to put uh, the color Deborah Shimmer. Put a layer of that. And then I'm going to put the Hope or the awareness cancer, the awareness ribbon. I can't ever say it, the awareness ribbon. So that's what that is. So I'm gonna put that in the middle of these and each one will be pink with the Sir Deborah Shimmer. And then that's gonna take like flickety split time with our UV resin, I love it. Oh good, it's already open, yay. Oh, you know what? Oh no. That was just really a dingbat moment. I was like, oh, wait, I forgot to mix up my resin. Hello. S silly Sam I am. All right, so we only need one of these little cups. I'm going to fill this up. Mm -hmm. I have not enough. Okay. So this, I made this for the ring. Hold the ring straight. I don't know if I, this is gonna sit, I don't think this lays straight, does it? Let's see. We have to open it and let it hang on the cup. No, how are we gonna do that? There we go. Do it like that, and then it lays flat. Okay. Woo! Put that there. And this lays flat. I don't need that. Alright, now let's mix up some of this. We will use, well, I guess I can use their little tool. Mix this up. Such a pretty pink. I love these pinks that Color Fashion has. I had a hard time choosing. My last video, you saw those colors, so I wanted to do a different color. So that's why I decided to go with, what did I say? Philip? I think it is Philip, because I thought it was odd Philip being pink. But hey, real men wear pink, right? Especially those who support breast cancer awareness. Okay, there we go. So let me pour some in the rain. And it just takes drops. And there's so little. A little bit more in each of them. Mm-mm. 
I ain't supposed to be watching that one. I mean, because I am going to dome it. We want it domed. That one's good. Man, that, oh, that one's like tilting. What's the deal? Go back. I got too much in there. I went overboard. I'm going to just sop it up. Like a biscuit, soaking up gravy. And green, I did green on. When I normally do these pendants, I would always paint instead of using uh, resin on that. I would paint the back, the metal part, and then. Um, then put re clear resin or whatever my design was and then cover it with clear resin. And I, that was always UV resin. I never used resin resin, epoxy resin making jewelry. Did I do that last time when I made jewelry? I don't recall. I don't recall there, my friends. Which that's no surprise, being long. Okay, so let's cure it. Move your UV resin out of the way that you don't want cured because that's what's gonna happen. It'll cure it, lickety split. Put that there. Put my lid on, it takes one second to put your lid on your products. So you don't spill it or worse. Okay, that was Deborah Shimmer that I'm using. All right, let's go. Just a cute little light. There's no timer on it, so it's just use your imagination. <laughs> I'll let that sit on those two. So what's happening, everybody? Is this this is kind of boring, I know, but take time to stop and then come back on. You know, let's just hang out for a minute. Let's talk. I don't know what to talk about. I have all these ideas I know that I want to do, and it's like, oh, I come up with this idea, then I want to do this idea, and I got a lot of stuff that I want to do with you guys. Oh, it does go off at a certain time. But see, that's still not um, cured. Takes a little while. So let me do this. I, it is going to take longer, and I don't want y'all to sit here and watch. Do, 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 do. So I'll be back. Okay, friends. I got the bottom pink, this uh, Deborah Shimmer. I got that cured with the little UV resin and the little UV light. I decided I had enough left over, so I thought I would make a magnet. This is just a little, let me show you what it looks like. I have the one, actually I have a lot of these. I never knew what to do with them. I hadn't used it before. This is the first time I've used it. I have so many pendants and stuff, it's crazy. I need to use them with you guys. It's just like this. So it, I thought the resin was going to run out the sides. It didn't. It stayed right where it was supposed to. All right, so I'm going to put that down there. Let's take it off. I don't know if the sticker around it's clear. I really hope it is. I really, really do. Mm, I'm trying to get it off. It's not clear. So I've cut it the best I could. I really wish it was clear, but that's what we got. Not bad, not bad. These have the survivor ribbon on it. So let's go ahead and do those. Can I say so one more time? <laughs> Let me do these first, because I don't want it to go out those uh, holes that we were just talking about. 
I think I'm going to do these one at a time because I'm doming it. Which means it's pretty full. Here we go. It's done beautifully. Do you see that on the side? Hold on, I'll show you. I'll show you better, but I wanted you to see what was happening. Instead of me just covering it and you can't see nothing. There you go. That's what I'm doing. I'm curing it. You see the little neat idea there, putting it in the cup so it'll hold it straight for you? I used to use a, or I had a um, styrofoam round thing like you would make a, something. Something you would make with styrofoam. I'm tired. I'm tired. It's like 12:30, and I had a four and a half hour drive today. I had to go to the doctor. Stayed overnight because I go four hours away. It's close to Raleigh, Durham, North Carolina. Duke. You may know that name if you're into sports, or if you're into school, good schools for medical purposes. All right. Now I'm going to move on to this one. When you have these type of findings or pendants and so forth, and you have your UV resin, you can make a uh, matching jewelry for every outfit that you have. You can already go out, hey, I did that before. I was wearing red, and I didn't have anything red because I'm not a red person, so I went and made me a necklace with red in it. No time. It was awesome. So it's a good thing to keep in mind if you have a lot of findings or things like this settings I guess would be the right name to say for that yeah I never showed you see how that can you tell see how that's domed pretty looks nice and brown I might do another coat really get it high oh man that one needs a little longer so yeah, I had these Hope ribbons. I got them on eBay a long time ago. Long time ago. But I'm sure you can find them anywhere. Just Google or search awareness ribbon pendants or uh, charms. That would be the best way to say that. This, I was not going to open this. I was going to send it back because I just didn't think I needed it. But this is so much better than, I mean, I love, don't get me wrong, I love my little flashlight, my little torch, and I will always use this. The batteries are just dead, and I don't have, I've gone through all my AAA, because they all fit our Roku remotes and all my flashlights, so. Alright, that one's nice and cured. I noticed this one does have a bit of an odor. Not pungent or something that's, you know, it's not like I can't stand it. It just, I noticed it. Go, baby. Put you under there, get you a little extra. I think I went over on this one. Dog on it. I did. Did. I did, I did. Oh, it's still wet. I can get it. Bear with me, y'all. I'm going to get this. I got lucky, lucky, lucky. Let me tell you. Oh, shut up. I don't think, I think the paint ran off of this, so I didn't get too lucky. The clear, I caught the clear, but the pink is on the bottom. Or at the top of the pendant. In there, see it? I need to...
Hey, I really wish this wasn't white, but this was an afterthought anyway. It's a magnet. It's not supposed to really match this set. This set is, it's its own thing. I'm gonna move this over and I can go ahead and, oops. I'll pour this one. I'm going to give them a little tool. I forgot to get the bubbles out. Oh, good. It stopped. How are you doing over here? I'll put you under there again. You're good. Yeah, so this is a nifty little contraption. There's my magnet. I have no E6000 or anything, so I'm just going to UV resin it on there. I sure am. So while I'm waiting on this, let me tell you about the three contests that I have going on. The details are down in the description. I'll just go ahead and go through them real quick. The first one is the like, subscribe, send me a comment letting me know that you liked and subscribed. Then I'm going to give you a number. Last time it was five, uh, 500 subscribers. Now when I get to 1,000 subscribers, I'm going to do a giveaway. Nobody, The person that won the 500 never replied back, so I still have this wonderful gift which is a pigment paste from Just Resin, uh, Ocean Basic Pack, I should say. So it's got five different um, pastes in it. It's very nice. Um, then the second contest I have is the honorary color you, uh, on my sh uh, channel. So you would have an honorary, your own color. Um, you tell me what family, color family you like, then I find a color for you. That color then becomes known as John Smith or John Doe. Whatever your name is, that color will be your color. If I use it, then your name goes into the joy box. It also goes in when I first introduce your color. You get uh, your first entry then. The third way that you can support the channel is um, by showing, or I should say the contest is showing some support for the channel. There's a few ways to do that. I have affiliate links down below. Use one of them coupon codes and get yourself something great and also help me. And plus get you in the Corny Amazing Acorn. It's just a big acorn, ceramic acorn, just like a cookie jar. But that's my Corny Amazing Acorn. And to get in there, you showed the support, which I said the affiliate links, um, if you get in do the honorary color program then you'll get in on the amazing acorn as well so that's two contests if you do the honorary color the third way if you have um supplies that you've purchased and you think you're not going to use them and you want to hand them down to sam i am give ask me for my address i'll send it to you i love hand-me-downs let's let me do something with it for you let's let's show the world or everybody out there in youtube land what we can do with your stuff then the fourth and final way, if you want to make a donation to PayPal, make, buy me a coffee. Oh, I think I now have the super thanks. So you could do that. I'm not quite sure exactly how that works. I just signed up for it. I don't know how much of this works. I'm just rolling with it. When I get an email, I try and study it all and get it all down pat. I just want to bring you guys videos showing you what I love to do and enjoy. However, you know there is red tape behind everything and that's where i'm at i just want my channel to grow so i can bring more projects to other people okay these are beautiful uh-oh that ran out that light ran out big time <laughs> here i was bragging i didn't think it was coming out but it did i might be able to cut that i don't know wipe up my little j diction uh silicone mat. I'm wiping, but I don't see nothing coming off. 
I don't know. That was an afterthought anyway, so I'll just put this one to the side. It's peeling off a little bit. I got a big, oh, look, I got it. I think I got it. By Georgia, I think I've got it. Yeah, look, it's coming off. Hey, saved. Um, I'm not quite sure why I still have pink uncured UV resin, though. Not sure what that's about. But it's cured. I'm able to wipe it, so I'm going with it, y'all. Everything turned out really well. All right, now I need to put the magnet on the back of this. Like I said, I don't have any E6000, so we're just going UV resin it down. got you a pendant I went around just see the top right there I don't know if you can see it or not but see where it went over a little bit so that's a little disappointing but crap happens and here's the pretty ring that pretty yeah I like it and then her beautiful bracelet. Isn't that pretty? I'll put my ring on with it. How awesome is that? I love it. I really, really do. I'm. If you're interested in buying it, let me know. I can make more if you don't get this one. Let me know. Actually, I've never said it. Anything that I make and you're interested in it, if nobody else is before you, let me know. Uh, heck, we'll figure out a price. I'm cheap. I just don't have a place to keep all this stuff that I make with you guys. But this is really, really pretty. I love it. So what do you guys think? Do you love it? You want to give me a thumbs up? You want to give me two thumbs up? Well, you can only do one, and I'll take it. And the other one that you were going to give me, you can use to subscribe, get notifications, or share, or do all three. You can do that with that extra thumb. And I will certainly, certainly appreciate it. Because I like this video. I think it turned out really, really well. I like what we did. This is for breast cancer awareness, which is not too far away in October. So that's it, guys. I'm going to go ahead and say my goodbyes. I've told you about the contest, so check out all the details down in the description. Let's see, this one should be done. There's our magnet. Yay! Showing our support. All right, my friends, that's it. I'm going to go on and head to bed. So... I love you, mean it. Until next time, be good or good at it. See ya. Bye.